Have you heard about the latest buzz in the car industry? Well, let me fill you in on some exciting news. Toyota is cooking up something new in their labs and they are excited to share it with us. Apparently, they believe hydrogen can be a viable option for future mobility. Move over, battery and gas? The new kid in town is about to shake things up. So, imagine a car that runs on hydrogen instead of gasoline. Sounds like something out of a sci-fi movie, right? But guess what? Toyota has made it a reality. It's a fancy way of saying they have figured out how to make cars that emit less carbon using existing technologies and abundant elements. The upcoming CEO of Toyota is really up to this thing. To know how the new CEO of Toyota shocked everybody, stay tuned till the end. Welcome to the evolutionary. Now, let's get started. Well, it is known to us that the Toyota Motor Corporation is the big fish in the automotive pond. It's like trying to persuade a cat to take a nap. It just comes naturally. And what's the secret to their success, you may ask? The Toyota Production System, or TPS for those in the know. With TPS, Toyota can churn out some of the most fantastic cars in the world without breaking the bank. They can also bring new products to market faster than a cheetah on a caffeine high. But it's not just the car industry that's reaping the benefits of TPS. Even hospitals and postal services have jumped on the bandwagon to improve their efficiency. As you can see, folks, the secret to Toyota's success is not just their cutting-edge technology and sleek designs. It's TPS. And now, it looks like Toyota is shaking things up again with their latest CEO announcement. Akio Toyota, the new CEO, talked about a couple of powerful things. So, the company is all about diversity. Instead of going full-on electric like everyone else, they decided to create hybrids with both gas and hydrogen batteries. And even though the old CEO is gone, the Toyota hydrogen engine team has been hard at work making strides. In fact, the new Toyota CEO recently showed off their fancy hydrogen combustion engine which has the potential to change the game. Who needs electricity when you can have hydrogen, right? So, before jumping to the main theme, let us first analyze why the need for this is so important. So, have you heard about the climate crisis? Apparently, the world is heating up faster than my coffee on a Monday morning, and the transportation industry is responsible for a whopping 15% of global carbon emissions. Yikes! But fear not, my friend, for there is hope. Thanks to the emergence of Tesla and some political legislation, the car industry is being forced to come up with ways to make cars that won't make Mother Earth mad. And while battery electric cars are currently leading the charge, there are other sustainable ways to propel a car. In fact, Toyota's CEO has some pretty interesting ideas on the matter. Basically, the Toyota CEO's main principle is to keep it open and let the people decide. Which sounds like a pretty solid plan, right? It's clear that a lot of folks believe that hydrogen is the way to go. I mean, it's the most abundant substance in the universe. So, that's gotta count for something, right? So, while we may not know which sustainable solution will be the de facto global choice in 50 or 100 years, it's important to keep an open mind and keep striving toward a cleaner future. Because if we don't, we might as well start building our houses on Mars now. Now, let me tell you about something really cool. Do you know those fancy hydrogen engines that use fuel cells to convert hydrogen into electricity? Well, Toyota has just taken things to the next level. They have recently unfilled their latest prototype car, the Corolla Cross H2 concept. And get this, it's powered by a hydrogen combustion engine. That's right! Forget fuel cells, Toyota's engineering team has developed a whole new way of harnessing the power of hydrogen. Now, I know what you are thinking, but won't that pollute the environment? Fear not my friend, the only byproduct of the exhaust pipe is good old H2O, making these babies not just more efficient but also eco-friendly. And that's not all, because of their longer ranges, you won't need to recharge them as often as other cars. How cool is that? But do you know what else is cool? Your support. If you are having a great time watching this video, please consider giving it a thumbs up and sharing it with your friends. 
And if you haven't already, be sure to subscribe to our channel and turn on notifications so you never miss a new upload. We appreciate your support and look forward to seeing you in the next video. And now, let's get back to the topic. Toyota is really taking things up a notch with this new technology. They are calling it the H2 Internal Combustion Engine, or H2Is for short. It's totally different from the fuel cell technology that powered their last hydrogen-powered car, the Toyota Mirai. If you are still not convinced, take a look at the GR Corolla H2 concept car. It's a beauty, and it's all part of Toyota's vision of using hydrogen as an alternative fuel. Who knows, maybe we'll all be driving around in hydrogen-powered cars sooner than we think. This car uses a 1.6-liter turbocharged 3-cylinder engine that packs a punch of 300 horsepower. And get this, this engine is also used in Toyota Corolla's sport race car. So, you know it's got some serious oomph. The H2 is based on the GR Corolla, a high-performance version of the popular compact sedan. It's got an all-wheel drive system, variable torque distribution, and a sport-tuned suspension. This baby aims to combine the performance and handling of the GR Corolla with the environmental benefits and potential cost savings of hydrogen fuel. Toyota claims that hydrogen can be produced from various renewable sources such as solar, wind, or biomass and can be stored and transported more easily than electricity. Plus, it's got a higher energy density than batteries, which means a longer driving range and faster refueling times. Who doesn't love a car that can go the distance and fill up quickly like your morning cup of coffee? So next time you are looking for a car that's both powerful and eco-friendly, Thing H2. It's a car that's sure to turn heads and make a statement. Plus, it's perfect for those who want to go green but still want to have some serious fun on the road. Having said that, the car is equipped with a heavy-duty fuel tank that holds hydrogen under high pressure for safety reasons. Toyota even went the extra mile and added stronger connecting rods, harder valves and valve seats, and fuel injectors that use gas instead of liquid. Now, let's talk about some other benefits of this new technology. One of the main drawbacks of electric cars is charging. If you are new to EVs, this can be a significant change you must adapt to. And let's be real, we have all heard some horror stories about EV charging. But fear not, my friend, with Toyota's hydrogen-powered car, you don't have to worry about charging as much. No need to frantically search for a charging station because the car is fueled up in a matter of minutes. With Toyota's new technology, you can enjoy a smoother ride and less time spent at the charging station. Who wouldn't want that, right? Apparently, the cars they build with this technology use 70% fewer raw materials like nickel and lithium. I don't know about you, but that sounds like some kind of magic to me. Now, I know what you are thinking. When are we actually going to see these things on the road? Well, unfortunately, Toyota hasn't given us a concrete timeline just yet, but they have decided to take it for a spin on the racetrack first. That's right, in 2022, Toyota's rookie racing team entered the GR Corolla H2 with a hydrogen combustion engine in Japan's Super Taikyu endurance races. And to get this, the chairman of Toyota, Akio Toyoda, drove in every race under the name Marizo. What's interesting about Toyota's approach to hydrogen combustion engines is that they use it in a hybrid system instead of just relying on it as the only power source. This gives you more options and can help you get around some of the problems with the technology, like the need for big fuel tanks. But of course, there are always doubters out there. Some folks are concerned about the efficiency of hydrogen engines compared to electric vehicles. But as every coin has two sides, similarly every concept got negative and positive approaches. Not everyone is jumping for joy about this move. Some people are giving Toyota flack for not being as electric-focused as their competitors. Now personally, I think it's great that Toyota is taking steps to reduce carbon emissions and improve the technology we use in our cars. And hey, if they can do it while also giving us some speedy racetrack action, all the better! Who knows, maybe one day we'll all be cruising around in H2 ice-powered rides like Marizo himself. So, there you have it folks, Toyota is taking the car game to the next level with its hydrogen-powered car. And who knows, maybe we'll be living in a hydrogen-powered world sooner than we think. 
Cheers to a brighter, cleaner and more efficient future. And that's all for now. We hope you have found our video interesting. Make sure to hit the subscribe button and turn on notifications so you never miss an update from us. Thanks for watching and we will see you 